One quick quail hunting story, the two of us were hunting uh, a couple years ago, three, four, whatever it may have been. And, uh, you know, we're kind of spread out chasing birds. And every now and then you, you lose track of exactly where everybody is. So I'm down in a canyon and, uh, and it's a pretty steep hill up ahead of me. And, and a, a bird flushes up that hill. And I can remember drawing and squeezing the, and as soon as I squeeze the trigger, I can see an orange hat way up on top of the hill. And I go, oh no, that's right at uh, my buddy Nuts here. And he <laughs> says, hey kid, you shot me. I said, no, I didn't, you're too far away. He says, no, you hit me in the ear. <laughs> so I go up the hill looking for him and I can't find him. Well, he's gone over the backside of a hill and now I'm looking around, I can't find him. I'm really cu curious to know if I really hit him. Well, he must not be hit too bad. He took off and I can't, well, we finally meet back up down at the bikes. When we get to the bikes, I look at his ear and he's got a little blood in his ear. And it's, you know, a drop or two is still there, but it's dry by now. Okay, we have a little laugh about it. It was really not, not a big deal. Well, he missed the point when he got back to the bikes and I had already pulled the BB clean out of my ear that went in the back up, up here and the blood actually was pouring out of my ear after I no, pulled the BB No, when I saw <laughs> there was a drop. That, that <laughs> I almost, clean it up with wet wipes. I wasn't even convinced he got shot. I think he scratched it on a, on a sticker bush, personally. Well, somehow, during spring training of that year, you probably know no, the, the next part of this because <laughs> you talked to a reporter about a funny story or a radio show or something. I was manager with the Cubs at the time, went to the winter meetings, was having a, a, a show with uh, Kevin Millar at the winter meetings and you know he's put me on the spot, hey what's one of one of the coolest stories you've, you've you know done lately blah 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 and I was like oh you know I was quail hunting the other day and you know Robin Young shot me in the ear when we were quail hunting. <laughs> So no big deal at the time, <laughs> like Robin said. About the next two days, there was headlines in every paper. Hall of Famer shoots Cubs manager in the air. <laughs> so, and the way it looked, it was like a deer hunting accident. Yeah, like they got shot by a rifle or something yeah. like that. <laughs> and I got calls and texts from friends like you can't believe, wondering if he was going to sue me. Is he okay? <laughs> Is he going to live? Yeah, it was. It got blown out of proportion yeah. so bad. I felt so bad because it was just on a whim. Like, oh, that was a cool story. Yeah, you know, Robin shot me in the ear, you know, quail hunting. And it wasn't <laughs> nothing, you know. So it was, it was a really, really bad ending to a funny story, I guess. It wasn't that funny for me because I didn't like uh, the way it went national that I shot my buddies.